In this video, I'm going to show you what is Mimikat and how we can extract the password from the Mimikat. So Mimikat is a, a open source that allow users to view and save authentication credential such as Carver's ticket. We can pass the hashes from NTLM. The Mimikat is Mimikat is the credential stealer. We can steal a credential and escalate the privilege. Also, we can get a golden ticket with the NTLM hash. So hash will pass the password. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Without wasting your time, I'm gonna show you how we can utilize and how the hackers easily gain the password plain text password or ntlm has or there are so many things we can do it for now i'm going to show you on the windows side we have to i do have the kali and windows machine so i'm going to show you on the windows machine i already download the mimicat and require file here so i'll put the link in the description below you so you can download from there let's assume that you already have access to the windows machine and where you can run the mimicat also mimicat is so powerful let me show you how you can download the mimicat you can compile these all files from here so you can go to github once you come here you can just download this code and open in the visual studio you can compile from there so that's how i did on this one and if you want to learn more about the mimicats you, you can go to wiki right here once you come here you can just literally see everything how you can do how you can pass the hashes how you can dump the credential login credential and so on i'll show you the few tips on this video if you like this video or if you want to research more things on the kali or if you like to deep down in the mimicad you can read all this article and you can go through there all right so without wasting your time let me open the mimicad and run this one make sure you disable the antivirus first so it will detect the mimic head but so right now it will detect it but the, like a microsoft sometimes it detects and then it doesn't detect sometimes but it depends so it's a rat and cat things right now so sometimes microsoft will decide it to detect it and if sometimes it doesn't detect so it depends so that will the basic things we have to turn off the window defender first once you open the mimic head, so you can type preview ledge colon colon debug so once you get the privilege 20 okay so that means we can run the commands for this one i i'm gonna download or i'm gonna extract this some password some login password so for this particular command is s e k u r l s a dub dub log on password okay so once you hit enter it will grab all your login password with ntlm hashes so just make sure you are able to grab and run this command okay all right there you go so once you comes here we can just we can grab this password sometimes it will show the clear test password but this this sometime it will say the clear tech password but However, NTLM has this, so this one is domain controller. So you can see username is this, and domain is lav, um, and server is DC, and the login is this, and SID. So we can, so 500, if you see, this is the administrator power. So now we have NTLM has, so we can pass this has with NTLM. What I can do is copy this and paste here notepad open the notepad and paste this one what i can do here is i'll do s e k u r l s a dub dub p t h p t h and user administrator and domain is lav dot local so i have the same thing right below um, i do have the same thing here so lab is a domain and the lab.local is our domain controller and ntlm so ntlm is this i what i want to run is run cmd 
Okay, so let's copy this and paste here. Once you hit enter, it will pass the NTLM hashes to the, the domain controller, which is administrator. Uh, we are going to privilege escalate it to the domain controller, which is administrator. What we did was we grabbed the NTLM password from here. We grabbed the local domain and then this is the lab.local and username is administrator and NTLM has this SID is this one. We can copy this SID and we can pass the SID with the administrator also. So, but we know the administrator, so I don't have to do that. Back to this. And once we hit enter, it will open the new command prompt. So see right here. So this is the so powerful Mimikaz tool. And then you can say, who am I? So administrator lab. Now what we have to do, you can, you can use net user and create a user with a different password so and you can log on from here but i'm not gonna show you here but i will show you one more thing with this one you can do for the task scheduler we can also grab the password from there so for that we can do vault dub dub c r e d crap this and you will see all this target name this is the other one and there are different things now but we don't see any credential here so so this one we can copy and pass it we can do the same thing for this one is for only the session it i don't think this is the powerful but also there's one more command which is vault dub dub colon colon lst so list you can see the vault this is the web credential name and the path is this and these are the things and also if you if you want to really deep dive into that you can export the golden ticket so also you can do ls dumb sam sam account you can just copy here and paste it here you can do cls and paste here hit enter and it will show you everything password related to so this is the PC to domain and so this is so powerful. I really personally say I like it. Deep down with this and check all those credentials. You can also elevate the like token thing. You can do it. I also can show you here. Open up that. Copy and paste here. So so impersonated so this is the so coral and then you can also use on the administrator lab administrator and this token you can do anti anti authority slash system so it's also impersonated this is super cool and um, if you really like my video please don't forget to subscribe like and share and if you have any questions please comment below my challenge to you is you can go ahead and take a more research in it you can also use utilize the mimicad with the meter printer